Hello mga kawawmats! Sa video lesson nito, i-discuss natin kung paano i-solve yung logarithmic inequalities. So the learning competency that, we, that you need to master in this video lesson is how to solve logarithmic inequalities. So when you say logarithmic inequality, that is a logarithm. So when you say a logarithm inequality is an in inequality that involves logarithm. So Pag sinabi natin inequality, ano yung mga symbol na makikita natin? Meron tayong makikita less than, greater than, greater than or equal or less than or equal. So, here are some examples of log logarithmic inequalities. Log of the quantity of 2x minus 1 with a base of 3 is greater than log the quantity of x plus 2 with a base of 3. Also, this one, log x with base 1 fifth is greater than log 1 fifth raised to negative 3 with base 1 fifth. And logarithm of x is greater than negative 2 but less than 2. So, the, yan yung mga halimbawa ng logarithmic inequalities. Now, uh, how to solve logarithmic inequality? So, paano ba natin ma-solve? So, gagamit lang tayo ng dalawang property. So, kapag yung base natin ay greater than 0 but less than 1, again, kapag yung base natin ay greater than 0 but less than 1, let's say your log x sub 1 with base b is greater than log to the log x sub 2 with base b, then, your x sub 1 is less than x sub 2. So, anong nangyari, class? Ni-reverse natin yung inequality symbol. Again, kapag yung base natin ay greater than 0 but less than 1, so, yung inequality symbol ng given natin ay magre-reverse. Okay? All throughout the solution. Next. If base great is greater than 1 and log x sub 1 with base b is less than log x sub 2 with base b, then your x sub 1 is less than x sub 2. So, mariretain lang yung inequality symbol natin. Hindi natin uh, i-reverse, -re retain lang kapag yung base natin ay greater than 1. For example, Example, Log x is less than or equal to 5 with base 3. So, una muna natin titingnan yung base natin. So, yung base natin is greater than 1. So, because 3 is greater than 1. At kailangan makuha natin that our... Ito, ito ha. Kailangan natin to... So, dapat laging greater than yung gagamitin nyo. So, your x should be greater than... 0. Okay? So, after that, so, sa mga ganitong uh, case, or in this example, uh, you can write it or to proceed and to solve the, the solution set. Okay, so, anong gagawin natin? So, pwede kayong, pwede nyong i-convert into exponential form. So, paano ba ginagawa ulit yung uh, exponential form? So, your x is less than or equal to 3 raised to 5. So, mapapansin nyo na hindi natin babaguhin yung, inequality, ay yung sim, inequality symbol natin. Why? Kasi yung base natin ay greater than 1. Then after that, evaluate natin yung 3 raised to 5. So, 3 raised to 5 is 243. So, yung x down natin is less than or equal to 243. So, sabi dito kanina, your x should be greater than 0. So, ibig sabihin, hindi exclude natin yung 0 and negative numbers. So, ano maging solution set natin? Your x is greater than 0 but less than or equal to 243. So, paano natin i-present into interval notation? So, pag interval notation, so open interval 0. So, kasi hindi kasama si 0, di ba? 
243. So, since uh, kasama si 243, kaya gaamit natin dito yung bracket. Okay, next. Log x is uh, greater than or equal to 6. So, that is with base 4. So, again, yung B natin or yung base natin is greater than 1 because 4 is greater than 1. And your X, so your X must be greater than 0. So, same process dun sa unang example. Uh, convert the uh, logarithm of X with base 4 greater than or equal to 6 in exponential form. So, therefore, X is greater than or equal to 4 raised to 6. And then, evaluate for raised to 6. And for raised to 6 is 4,096. Again, hindi natin babaguhin yung inequality symbol natin all throughout the solution kasi yung base natin ay greater than 1. So, x is greater than or equal to 4,096. And that is also x is greater than 0. So, ang titingnan nyo dito kapag greater than, so same naman sila, greater than, no? Hindi na natin kukunin to, no? Mawawala ng uh, ano na yung greater than 0. Kasi mas mataas yung 4,096. So, therefore, from 4,096, oh, kasama ha, included yung 4,096 to positive infinity. Okay, yan yung solution set natin. Okay? Next. Log x plus 8 with base 6 is less than or equal to 2. So, kunin ulit natin since yung base natin is greater than 1 because uh, that is 6. No? 6 is greater than... Okay, since 6 is greater than 1, so therefore, yung inequality symbol natin ay retain. And then... Kunin muna natin to, no? yung x plus 8 natin. So, ang x plus 8 dapat natin is greater than 0. So, x plus 8 is greater than 0 and then simplify. So, x is greater than negative 8. So, dapat yung x natin is greater than negative 8. So, after that, so you can convert this into exponential form. So, that is x plus 8 is less than or equal to 6 squared. And then, uh, evaluate 6 squared. That is, x plus 8 is less than or equal to 36. And you can add uh, on both sides by negative 8. So, therefore, x is less than or equal to 28. So, less than or equal to 28. So, yung x daw natin is less than or equal to 28. And, your x is greater than negative 8. So, paano natin ilagay yun? So, kapag dito ay less than, tapos dyan ay greater than, so, yung x nyo, ilagay nyo sa gitna. So, your x is greater than negative 8, but less than or equal to 28. Tatandaan nyo? Okay? So, ganyan natin siya i-represent. So, using interval notation, so, mula kay negative 8 to 28. So, open interval negative 8 to 28. Bakit? Uh, Nakabracket to. Ibig sabihin, si 28 ay part ng solution. Next. Log 2x minus 1 with base 3 is greater than log of x plus 2 with base 3. So, same process, no? That is, uh, yung base natin is... Okay, so since yung 3 natin ay greater than 1, so therefore yung inequality symbol natin ay retained. So hindi natin babaguhin all throughout the solution. So 2x minus 1, so kunin muna natin, kailangan kasi importante ma-insure natin na yung logarithms natin are defined. So kunin natin. 2x minus 1 is greater than 0. Then simplify. So, it will become 2x is greater than 1. So, and then after that, so, nag-add lang tayo on both side by positive 1. And then, divide both side by 2. So, x is greater than 1 half. So, dapat yung x natin is greater than 1 half. x plus 2 is greater than 0. 
So, your x is greater than negative 2. So, dal may dalawa tayong ditong x. So, kung ano yung mas mataas dyan, yun ang uh, kunin nyo, no? So, tingnan natin yung makukuha natin dito sa uh, given natin. So, yung x dapat natin is greater than 1 half. So, kung ang x is greater than negative 2, dapat yung x natin is greater than 1 half. Okay? Doon tayo sa mas mataas. Okay. 2x minus 1 is greater than x plus 2. So, ma ano na to Mawawala na yung log 3, no? Ay, log with base 3. So, since same naman sila, kunin na natin yung 2x minus 1 is greater than x plus 2. So, you can add uh, on both sides by positive 1 and negative 2, no? You can... No, you can add both sides by negative x and positive 1. Okay? So, you can combine uh, like terms. 2x minus x is greater than 2 plus 1. So, 2x minus x is x and x is greater than 3. Okay, tingnan natin. So, yung x natin is greater than 1 half. Lahat pareha silang greater than. Tapos dito, x is greater than negative 2 and x is greater than 3. So, sino ang mas mataas sa tatlo? Yung greater than 3. So, therefore, ito yung kukunin natin. So, therefore, the solution is from 3 to positive infinity. Ganun, ganun yung gawin nyo. Next. Log uh, 3x plus 2 with base 5 is less than log 2x plus 5 with base 5. So, same process. Since 5 is greater than 1, therefore, yung inequality symbol natin ay di magbabago. So, kunin ulit natin yung value ng 3. Uh, you should, kailangan ma-define muna natin, no? Yung logarithm natin. So, 3x plus 2 is greater than 0. Then, 3x is greater than negative 2. So, x is greater than negative 2 third. At yung isa, 2x plus 5. 2x is greater than negative 5. And x is greater than negative 5 over 2. So, your x is greater than negative 2 third. And x is greater than negative 5 over 2. So, kunin natin ito. Since same naman sila. So, 3x plus 2 is less than 2x plus 5. Combine like terms. So, 3x minus 2x less than 5 minus 2. So, 3x minus 2x is x is less than 3. So, magkaiba sila, right? So, dalawa yung greater than natin dito. x is greater than negative 2 third. Tapos dito, x is greater than negative 5 over 2. Pero nakuha natin x dito is less than. So, therefore, kunin natin dito sa dalawa yung mas mataas. Sino ba yung mas mataas dyan? Yung negative 2 third. So, therefore, yung x natin dapat ilagay nyo sa gitna. So, x is greater than negative 2 third but less than 3. Or, so, you can, uh, using interval notation, that is from negative 2 third to 3. So, pareha silang uh, open interval tapos close interval kasi class uh, hindi naman kasama si negative 2 third and 3 kaya parenthesis yung gagamitin nyo next log x with base 1 fifth is greater than log 1 fifth trace to negative 3 with base 1 fifth so kitang kita naman na yung base natin ay Greater than 0 but less than 1 Or your 1 fifth is greater than 0 but less than 1 So, ibig, ano ibig sabihin yan? Yung greater than na uh, given sa so, so, Magbabago, no? Magre-reverse tayo Okay? So, your x must be greater than 0 So, ito yung sinasabi ko Kapag ang base natin Kapag ang base nyo ay greater than 0 but less than 1 So, sa so solution natin mag Re reverse tayo. Kung greater than yan, so less than tayo dito. Kung less than to dito, magre greater than tayo. So, kunin natin x is less than 1 fifth raised to negative 3 and evaluate 1 fifth raised to negative 3. That is 125. So, ang x daw natin is greater than 0 and dito x is less than 125. So, 
Magkaiba tayo, no? Ito greater than, then less than. So, ang x natin na sa gitna. Ganun lang yung gawin nyo. So, x is greater than 0 but less than 125 or from 0 to 125. Another, another example, we have log 2x minus 4 with base 1 half is less than log x minus 5 with base 1 half. So, after that, uh, since 1 half is greater than 0 but less than 1, so, ibig sabihin yung inequality symbol natin ma magre-reverse tayo. So, kunin muna ulit na, kunin natin yung 2x minus 4. So, laging greater than ang gagamitin nyo dito. 2x minus 4 is greater than 0. Simplify. 2x is greater than 4. Divide both side by 2. So, that is x is greater than 2. Yung isa naman, x minus 5 is greater than 0. So, x is greater than 5. So, your x is greater than 2 and x is greater than 5. So, kunin natin. 2x minus 4 is greater than x minus 5. And then, combine like terms. So, 2x minus x is greater than. So, nakita nyo class from less than, greater than. No? Magre-reverse tayo. So, negative 5 plus 4, that is negative 1. So, x is greater than negative 1. So, makikita nyo class, pare-pareho silang greater than. So, x is greater than negative 1 x is greater than 2, and x is greater than 5. So, kapag ganito class na same sila, kukunin lang, nyo, kukunin lang natin yung pinakamataas. So, ang pinakamataas is yung 5. So, therefore, yung solution natin is from 5 to positive infinity. Okay? Next. Log x is greater than negative 2 but less than 2. So, uh since uh, your x must be greater than 0, pwede natin paghiwalayin to log Logarithm of x is greater than negative 2. So, tapos yung isa, logarithm of x is less than 2. And then, kagaya kanina, paano yung proseso natin kanina? Okay, you can uh, convert this into exponential form. So, that will become... Uh, by the way, this is a common logarithm. no? So, ibig sabihin, kapag common logarithm, yung base natin ay 8. 10. So, x is uh, greater than 10 raised to negative 2. Okay? And 10 raised to negative 2 is that is 1 over 100. Doon naman sa kabila. So, same format. So, x is less than 10 squared and 10 squared is 100. So, magkaiba naman sila, no? So, x is greater than 1 over 100 and x is less than so Pag nilagay natin yan, that is x is greater than 1 over 100 but less than 100. Or, using the interval notation, so ganito. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you learned something. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell button para updated kayo for more video tutorial. This is your guide in learning your math lesson, your Wow Math channel.